State lawmakers may change when you need to use your turn signal. CBS4 State House reporter Kristen Escow has more on the proposal that law enforcement says will help while making traffic stops. Using a turn signal in Indiana is actually required under two different laws. Now, Indiana lawmakers want to make it just one. It's just removing these impossibilities. It's removing the technical violations that weren't necessarily da da dangerous. Legislators have proposed cutting the requirement to signal 200 feet before a turn or lane change or 300 feet if you're on a highway. You would still be required to signal before turning or changing lanes, just not at a specific distance. The Indiana Public Defender Council is advocating for the change. It will help reduce the number of people stopped. Um, you know, a traffic stop can take anywhere from 10 minutes to 20 minutes. Advocates say in many urban areas, you simply can't use a turn signal 200 feet before the turn, and that even applies to some intersections here near the state house. You can go from street to street and not have, uh, you know, two, 200 feet or so uh, to even uh, activate your turn signal. Lawrence Police Chief Gary Woodruff says he's not sure if the legislation would reduce the number of traffic stops by his officers, but he doesn't have a problem with the change, since it takes the burden off of officers to judge the distance. Was it 170 feet? Was it uh, 230 feet? What, you know, what, which was it? That's asking an awful lot. Of, uh, of an officer in a dynamic environment, in a fluid environment. Still, some Hoosiers have concerns. It just seems like it would only make things easier for lazy drivers. Let's enforce it. Let's make people do it, not make it easier to not do it. At the State House, Kristen Escow, CBS 4 News.